That's enough resting. I better get back to work. It's hard. It got harder after you left me. I know that you are proudly looking from above. You don't need to cry as always. I will do it for you. For us even. Soon, we will be happy again. Smell of those tasty meals she used to prepare for us and our friends. I miss the old days. I remember how Alia got so happy when we bought this one. Can't imagine why. My first 256 core processor prototype, world's finest I must say. The things we can do with nanotechnology. Ah, this beautiful masterpiece right here. My magnum opus. Never thought I'd finish this after months of setback, but here it is. World's fastest microprocessor. Designed specifically to operate in nearly 10 terahertz frequency. The kind of speed one needs to wander deep down in someone's brain. That's why humanity needs Alia. I promise them happiness and joy. What was that? This tiny little hologram kept my mind at ease at the times I was frustrated by the work. I still remember it like yesterday when Alia gave it to me on my birthday. This tiny little hologram kept my mind at ease at the times I was frustrated by the work. I still remember it like yesterday when Alia gave it to me on my birthday. Whoa! What is this? Some kind of portal? I should see what's on the other side.
What is this place? I noticed that you made substantial progress with your project. You are wasting such a potential in a very wrong way. You can promise much more than happens. You have to look at things from a wider perspective. It doesn't matter what I am at the moment. You will have to face difficult journeys to understand me. I've been following you and your work for a long time. It will be a milestone if you use all there correctly. What you should do is think reasonably and not waste your project for the sake of enthusiasm. Doesn't matter. You aren't asking the right questions. There is a way to stop the rottenness and deprivation of the society you're living in. You say that people are unhappy. You promise that happiness. Instead of that, did you ever think to get to the root of the problem? You have fought again and again throughout history. For what? Money, glory, and power. Things that make humanity happy in a short way. Think of how many suffered in return. You promised nothing different. Doing the same thing over the course of a thousand years and complaining of unhappiness. I promise you the attitude. Instead of offering a life in an artificial environment to all these people, you can change their existing lives. Lives without hatred, disdain and revenge. Civilizations formed by these lives will have beatitude. Civilizations that fail to do this are doomed to succumb to themselves and perish as before. It's not about war only. It's the people who don't empathize and hate each other. Good people disappear among the corrupted ones. The innocent suffer along the guilty. Go to the epoch of ancient Greece using Alia. That place will be the beginning of salvation. What you should do next is something you will discover in the past. Past is an obsession that people cannot overcome. Learning lessons from the mistakes made in the past is the first step towards the brighter future. It will be a hard journey. The events that you will witness will make you understand what I said better. I didn't finish Alia yet. My dream Alia will let people visit the past and experience the period they want. Every person will visit the period that will make them happy. What you want from me is something that will take much time. You show up out of nowhere, patronize me, you expect me to trust you. This will take time. If you mean it, and if I have the slightest chance of changing the things, you have to give me more details. I am here because I knew you would listen to me. It would be a hard journey, but don't... Turns out I'm the only hope of humanity. <laughs> Facial recognition approved. Entry authorized. Welcome, Kavanch. Kavanch, are you thinking of her again? You worked hard for years, and now you achieved your dream. The past is yours. I can't understand your Greece insistence. Happiness is one step ahead. Isn't what you want the most to live with your spouse once again? Yes, I can see her one more time. 
but that will be nothing more than living my memory again. I was aware of this from the very beginning. No matter how much I want, I can't bring her back. There's no way to ease my pain, but maybe, just maybe, I can change others' lives. She would want me to do this. I don't have doubt about that. Firstly, I will visit ancient Greece. Okay, I understand. Alia will be proud of you. Let's begin when you are ready. I'm ready. When this is all over, we'll pop a champagne with you. With pleasure. Soon, your body temperature will drop, and you may tremble a bit. Your body will stiffen. I am now lowering the device. Once it is ready, it will lock itself to your head to prevent any discalibration. Alia is now calibrating itself for you. It should be over soon. I've never seen this city this silent. It's a strange feeling. Maybe it's because I'm not familiar, but it makes me nervous. I have to be brave. My family needs me. Keelan! Alana! Where are you? I came for you! Why are you screaming, Kavanch? Where are you? Don't be afraid, I'm here to help. I don't know what's going on with you. But you're the one who needs help. Remember why you're there. I'm here to rescue my family. I can't find you. Where are you? Feels like you're talking in my head. <sighs> Alia causes loss of memory, apparently. So you don't remember me. You broke my heart. I am your assistant. I'm speaking from the lab right now. Unfortunately, you can't see me. You called me Kvanch. Who is he? Really? Let me remind. You are the creator of Alia, Kvanch. Alia? Alia is a technology that enables you to relive the past. Sometimes you need to tell me in detail how it works. Technology? Oh my god. Just try to remember why you're there. I'll be in touch with you. My reason is to find my family. They are everywhere. Everywhere is crawling dead. My family, I... I need to... I need to find them. Kavanch, you have to understand this. They are not your real family. I guess what you're going through right now feels very real, but... SHUT YOUR MOUTH! I need to go home. Right now. Please. Please, God. Don't let anything happen to them.